Nearly 500 people have gone missing in Nebraska and remain missing today. And for one Omaha family, closure came with the worst news. Their daughter was found, but she was no longer alive. WWT 6 News' Matthew Smith has more on the lasting legacy of Amber Harris. This empty seat doesn't mean a young girl's presence isn't being felt. Her spirit is still around us today. I can feel it. That feeling is Amber Harris. Her mom says that while Amber's life is over, Amber's her work angel. here isn't. And I know she will help other people who are going through the same thing as we are. Flanked by other families affected by tragedy, Harris remembers her daughter's life. It was snuffed out nearly 10 years ago. She was last seen on November 29th. This is video of the day she last stepped off her bus. When she walked off that bus, her feet landed in the same park her mother stands in now. And help us to do more, help people to step up where there's no answers. The hardships Harris felt led to the creation of this group, a hand to hold, a group that brings help and hope to victims of violent crimes, and in other cases, those whose loved ones have simply vanished. Just come home, Cindy, we need you. Cindy Valle went missing in August of 2011. She was never heard from again. She was 15, pregnant, and no tips ever came in. We still have no clue, no nothing of her. Now their hope lies in this picture that perhaps someone will recognize her and bring about a reunion four years in the making. <laughs> in the meantime, these families come together to hope, pray, and remember each and every family shaken by tragedy. All of them. Josue and Mommy to Oscar. As balloons float closer to their loved ones, Melissa Harris shares one final message. We need to stay diligent in watching your kids. They can be taken in a matter of two seconds. Just a matter of seconds. That's all it took to change one family's life. But there is a lasting memory. Even 10 years later, you see the symbols on these pamphlets and flyers from that group. John Mallory, that's Amber Harris's hand. Yet another lasting memory of her life. Thanks, Matt. Well, Harris told us tonight she's trying to get a commemorative plaque made to put where her daughter was last seen. There's no timetable yet on when that may happen.